One local school blended learning and fun with a bit of Disney mixed in to reinforce reading skills at the elementary school level. Carrie Oculum, the brainchild of Miranda Fergus, teacher at Arthur Smith Primary, brought parents, students, and teachers together in a relaxed outdoor atmosphere after months of online learning, which saw students missing out on social interaction. Tonight's event is called Karaokeculum. It's a blend of two words, karaoke and curriculum. The curriculum that we are focusing on tonight is the reading curriculum. Reading or literacy instruction has some vital components that we felt that the parents really need support in being able to develop. Those feelings came from what we observe as teachers during the online learning as well as when the students return to the physical classroom, we, we noticed the deficits that they needed. Recognizing that learning takes many formats, the reading coach threw out a challenge to other schools while stressing the importance of early childhood learning. Our theme for karaoke Kalim today was the Disney theme. We know that children all over the world love Disney, so we decided to start with a bang and have give persons the opportunity to come dressed up, teachers included, in their favorite character because characters are a part of stories. And one thing that sometimes we recognize as adults is that students or children have a separation between the character in a story, in a movie, and a character in a book. So we want them to understand that they're, they're one and the same. Every movie that is shown came from some piece of written work that can be read and written. Whether belting out lyrics from Disney's Beauty and the Beast or We Don't Talk About Bruno Anymore from Encanto, another popular Disney soundtrack favorites, students practice their reading and enunciation skills while parents and teachers took the opportunity to channel their inner songbird. The literacy specialist also hopes the event will become an annual affair, growing to encompass other subject areas. Anne-Marie Bailey, CBC News.